Curling at the Paralympics, Sonia Gaudet and her Canadian team taking on China Tuesday. This was a bit of an adventure for the Canadian team. We'll start in the first end with Jim Armstrong, with what appears to be a simple takeout for one to end the first. He's just a bit off the mark and through the house, one to nothing China. Ahead of the third end, trailing two to nothing, Armstrong has another draw to get on the board. This time though, Racks his own yellow stone and suddenly China has a three to nothing lead on the defending Paralympic champs. Four to nothing now in the fifth. But finally some good possibilities for Canada with lots of yellow in the circles. And this time Armstrong is on the mark. A straight takeout for three. Canada is back in the game. China is trying to hang on, but they get in a mess of trouble again in the seventh. 5-3 the score, final shot for China, into another full house of Canadian rocks, and again the Chinese skip gets unlucky as Canada takes four for a come from behind 7-5 lead, 8-5 Canada the final, Canada improves to 5-1. and one. The one thing about our team is we really don't um, get down on each other, get down in those situations. It actually makes us uh, sort of band together even a little more. And um, so it was just a matter of um, playing a little bit of different strategy. And I mean, Jim's the guy who can call, you know, um, any kind of game in any situation. So um, we got some points on the board and uh, started to feel a little bit better about um, um, getting the rocks where we needed them to be. And um, yeah, it ended out in our favor in the long run.